My love for the law stemmed from a young age. I really saw the law as the way of being an advocate, and particularly for uh, gender and racial equality and making sure there's fairness in our system of justice. Helena is extremely committed and passionate about her profession, um, both as a lawyer and as a judge, and I've known her in both contexts. And uh, not only can you tell how much she loves what she does, but she, um, she tries to convey that to uh, young people, young lawyers, uh, law students, and anybody that might possibly follow in her footsteps. The thing that's most impactful, I think, about City Court is that it's an everyday court for everyday problems, everyday people. There are often not attorneys that represent the people that come before the court. And so my role in trying to understand what the problems are, relating with people well in terms of explaining the process, talking with them in ways that are not using what we call legalese and language they may not understand, as well as trying to break it down in very layman terms, as we call it. That's my role. And then my approach is trying to understand where they're coming from, from both their life experiences and human aspects, while letting them be, know what the, you know, the clear legal standards are. And sometimes people miss the mark, and sometimes people are close to the mark, but I have to bring that all together for them to understand that the decision I make is based on a fair um, and, and a careful review of all of the facts. One of Helena's greatest accomplishments, I think, professionally, has been the fact that she was the first African-American female to sit on the Albany City Court bench. Um, but she's done uh, so many other things and won so many awards for her community activities, her activities with the law school, with the bar so various bar associations. Um, she's always been a leader. Being selected a woman of excellence in the professions is an amazing, amazing, I'm filled with gratitude, it's amazing recognition. Um, I've put so much time and energy to make sure that whatever I do has a positive impact for my community in the courtroom, outside of the courtroom. Women, we are a powerful gender, are we not? We are a powerful human presence. We are people that should be looked at in the same way as everyone else, but we're not always looked at as everyone else. And to be recognized among this wonderful class of women that make up the Women of Excellence, to tell, uh, it tells me that I'm having an impact to help others succeed, uh, the young people that are gonna be our leaders of tomorrow, young people, people of color, that don't often have the same opportunities as others. To me, that makes a big difference to have a role in that.